Tough to come up on the losing end. Uh, you guys kind of dig yourself a hole early, but uh, what was it like to get the call after Ty Reasoner goes out? Oh, the coach just prepared us through the week. Uh, I was ready. I was kind of surprised, you know. Um, first experience, it was, it, was, it was fun. Well, you were able to get your first touchdown pass also to, uh, to a true freshman. Tell us about uh, the throw. Yeah, um, it was one-on-one -on -one over there. I saw JB over there. He's my floor mate in the dorms, and uh, had to give him some love, you know. <laughs> well, you get the two-point diversion right after that. Obviously, you're down 21 nothing. Uh, that's obviously a big hole to come out of. When you came in, uh, obviously you said you were prepared to go. Any nerves out there? Oh, yes, for sure, for sure. Being thrown out there like that. Um, I'm just really proud of uh, how everybody stepped up. Defense came, made stops, and they kept us in the game. Well, and, uh, you know, you get out there, you're trying to make something happen, and sometimes uh, picks happen, and they yeah. happen to you a little bit today. Yeah, a um, couple of mistakes on my part, uh, but we'll get that fixed next week. Looked like he had the running game going a bit too with another freshman back there, Kai Callis. Yeah, Kai was tearing it up. Uh, the O-line really stepped up there after half, and uh, that's what helped us uh, get the run game down, helped me uh, with a little more of my throwing game too. He almost made the comeback, 24-21, almost uh, get all the way back, and your feet are now wet uh, as a collegiate football player. How's that feel? Feels good. Um, I'm proud of the way uh, everyone stepped up today, and uh, it was a fun experience. Braxton, good job of Coach Karen Higgins. Coach, uh, kind of dug yourself a hole early, 21 zip in the yeah. first half. You just about get all the way back. Uh, your thoughts um, on your team's effort today? Yeah, I mean, our tell it two halves, of course. I mean, we played with a sense of urgency the second half. I don't know why we didn't come out with that urgency the first half. And, you know, I, I, you know, it's turn the ball over. First half of hurt us and uh, gave up the big play, the thing that's hurt us all year and dug ourselves a hole. And then when, when Ty went down, you know, we had to go with Braxton. And really, I thought Braxton played great. I mean, you know, to put him in that situation, it really changes a lot of things. I mean, you know, Braxton doesn't, you know, he gets reps during the, the past two weeks or past, you know, three weeks. And, and uh, he's done a good job. And But, you know, that's a lot of pressure to put on a true freshman. I thought he handled it well. I, I mean, he's going to, you know, we have some talented young quarterbacks. I think you see that, Ron. And, um, and our kids fought really, really hard. We just dug ourselves too big a hole there in the first half to overcome it. And I thought we were going to overcome it. I honestly did. I mean, I, you know, it, we got the ball there with about two minutes and oh, I don't know what, about 30 some seconds or something like that, I think maybe. And, you know, maybe should have just played a little bit more underneath stuff, you know, caught, caught some things and got the ball in good field position before we tried to try to go, go for the jugular, you know, I mean, because we still got time. But, but it was, like I said, it was a tell of two halves. Proud of my football team, the second half, you know, I, we definitely didn't come out and play well the first half. We were sleepwalking, and uh, once we woke up, but it was it was too late. Just a couple of uh, 